Hello guys, this is gonna be the dish of today, a codfish with a cooking cream. This is the, the ingredients. I'm only missing there a little bit of salt. We have the chip, the stick chips, the fried, uh, I don't even know how you guys call this, but those kind of chip, it's, the, it's a very easy thing to make like this. Two onions, garlic, black pepper, cooking cream, and codfish and of course I have cheese there after to put in the end okay guys see you guys in a little bit here is go guys we are gonna start with the onion oh god with the onions here cut it. I don't need to cut it in very small pieces but Very, very easy thing to make. Fast. It's an easy thing to make, guys. Fast and delicious. You guys only need onions, garlic, the codfish, of course. And I use the cooking cream. The cooking cream here, right here. And I use this chips. Normally I make them myself, but this uh, fried potato sticks, that's what it says here. I, I use that. It's a very easy thing to make, guys. Very, very easy, very tasty. In the end, it goes in the oven with a little bit of cheese on top. And it's very, very, very good fast thing to make. I'm just gonna cut all this in pieces and the garlic also. And I will be showing you the next steps right after guys. Okay guys the garlic is all here. The onions are here. I put a little bit of garlic here inside already. I'm gonna put a little bit of olive oil. Not too much. Just a little bit. Look. That's it. I'm gonna put it there and we're gonna continue just in a little bit. Here we are for the cut fish with the cooking cream here. It's here to uh, get a little bit of color. The onion and a piece of garlic, the rest of the garlic I put it right after. Let it start to warm up. And here we go, guys. Here we go, guys, to do another video over there. For you guys to enjoy a little bit. This is a thing that we do often, especially the Portuguese people. I don't know if they have something like this or closer to this in, a, in another another country or something I have no idea if they have something like this then uh, this is warming up I, I don't know if it's only in my, in my culture they have something like this we'll see we'll see see guys it's starting Put the rest of the garlic over here. The rest of the garlic. Just 
just do a little bit of browning. Better. So guys, it's running a little bit. Now I'm gonna put the oven. Warming up at uh, at Fahrenheit, it's 400, and at um, Celsius, it's 200. It's an easy thing. It's not. It's gonna, not going to take long in the oven, anyways. Like five to ten minutes. You see, guys, it's brown already a little bit. You see? You see it, guys? Here, a little bit brown. Now I put the codfish right here. Look. It's like a half a kilo, one pound that I'm doing. It's only this is good like for two to three people. It depends on how you guys eat. Me, I like to eat. For me, it's for two people. If they eat like me, it's two times. Put a little bit of black pepper. Black pepper. Black pepper. Oh. That taste, you know me, I like it with black pepper. See? Like this. Mix it up. Just a little, a little bit, a few seconds. See? When it stays here, just a few seconds. I'm going to open the cook the cooking cream. Look okay, here, the, the cooking cream. Right here, I put I put the cooking cream inside. You see the cooking cream is all inside. Mix it up. Up. and now it's gonna cook here like a good uh, not too much like five minutes I'm gonna wait until it starts boiling and I will be right back with you guys again okay guys see you in a little bit okay it's just start boiling here see guys just let it cook a little bit not too much because the codfish it doesn't need to cook just for the sauces when you guys see that the sauce is starting to get a little bit thick, it's time to mix up the the chip sticks, how they call this again, the fried potato sticks. Or you can do it like this instead of you buying like this. You can do it the the chips yourself. You can fry potatoes in sticks or in in cubes and. Me, sometimes I do it when I fry the potatoes, the potatoes myself, I do it in, I cut it in small cubes. It stays good the same, you know. But like this, it's a little, it's faster and uh, easier, like to do it in a fast thing. See, the sauce is already starting to get a little bit thick. You guys see? It's starting, it's starting. Let me open here the chips here. Let's 
That's an easy, easy, easy dish to do. The oven is already getting warm. Yes. Like a minute more or something, it's good to uh, put the, the chips over there. And I didn't put salt yet, I'm gonna taste it just to see. I'm not even gonna taste, I'm gonna taste it in the end because of, this has salt too. And I'm not even gonna put salt guys, like this. When I do it the, uh, with the homemade uh, fried potatoes, I always uh, put a little bit of salt because I don't put salt on the potatoes. But this one, it's they have already salt over there. See, very good. That's a good way for to make the Portuguese codfish with cooking cream and cheese on top after. And I'm gonna show you guys. I'm gonna start to mix, lower the fire a little bit. I'm gonna start to mix this, this uh, fried potato. You always forget the name of this thing. The fried potato sticks. Fried potato sticks, you see guys like this. I'm gonna add almost for sure all the pack over there. This is a 500 gram pack, a half a kilo. Oh guys, it smells good. Okay, I'm gonna put more. It's very good and uh, easy to make. Oh God. I always do a little mess when I do this. You see, it's still a lot of sauce over there. You can put the rest of I'm gonna put the rest of the sauce. Just a little bit careful to mix it up. I'm gonna mix it slowly, then I show you guys in a little bit how it's gonna be, or else it's gonna be a very, very long video. And I don't want that for you guys to be bored, okay? I'm gonna mix it, and I'll be back with you guys in a little bit. Here we are, guys. The And it's already mixed, as you guys see. Always with the fire on a little bit. Now I turn it off. I already have here this piece of thing here. And I'm gonna push this here a little bit back for you guys to see a little bit more proper. I think you guys are gonna see it like this here. A little bit more. this like this the fire is off already now I'm gonna put all this thing here slowly like this Now I just fix it here, guys, like this. I hope you guys are watching good. Let me put a little bit more there. Like 
this, I put it like this here. I tie it up in the corners, like this. Tie it up like this in the corners, like this, look. Try to uh, level it up. This is a good thing to do. You even don't dirty a lot of dishes. If you guys are like me, I don't. That's the part that I hate. It's to wash the dishes. Now it's uh, the cheese part. I have uh, two mozzarella cheeses. I have this one. It's a uh, cheese from here, and I have this one. This is one is from the lasagna. It's a leftover that I have. I put cheese on top here. Like I said, the oven is already preheated at four, 400 Celsius, uh, 400 degrees Fahrenheit and 200 Celsius. I have to put a little bit more cheese. with cheese that's why I put a little bit cheese here you have people that don't like much cheese you can put the quantity you want guys me I like it with cheese okay here we are looks like this guys Okay, after I put the cheese, it looks like this, guys. You see? Oven time, okay? Put it on the oven. I cannot tell you after how long it's gonna take there. See you guys in a little bit. Okay, guys, here you guys go. Here it is. The thing is done. It looks like this. See, I let it, I like the, the cheese to get a little bit brownish. It's still hot, like you guys see, it's still boiling over there. You guys can hear it. Right there. That's the way it looks. And I'm gonna do a little plate here just for you guys to see. Just a little plate. I'm gonna use even the, I'm gonna use this. Just for you guys to see, look, look. I'm gonna put this up a little bit under the cheese just for you guys to see how it is how does it look and this is the final dish you see guys it stays like this I hope you guys enjoy it and uh, if you guys taste it leave the comments and thank you so much for joining on the video here thank you take care bye bye